the, 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 the penis. Hey guys, it's Dear Esther. Oh, yes. I, this game I, is very strange. I played it the other day, and it's strange. And why can't I click start? What the fuck is going on? Uh, <laughs> it's Monday, Monday. Fuck you, Timmy. It's Monday. Actually, it's Sunday. So it's Sunday, Sunday, not for Friday, day, Friday. Day. Who is this black man? He look like he looks like Coco Pop. <laughs> <laughs> the hell, man? If if I remember, I'm so gonna splice it into the video right here. So chilling in the front <laughs> Who is this black guy? I took a thing. He looks like like Coco Pop. What? That your men are going to be called Coco Pop? There we go. That if 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 I did it, then you'll see it. If I did not, then just ignore everything that just happened. <laughs> what did just happen? Oh, oh, hockey, 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 hockey. Your daughter, hockey, hockey. This game takes ages to load. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm on an island. The morning after I was oh. there, salt in my ears, sand in my mouth, and the waves... Oh, I thought there were fire arrows! You and shut up, Chris! This one last shipwreck. I remembered By the way, guys, Chris here is Gingy231 on YouTube. Don't visit him, because all of his videos are shite. <laughs> they all involve uh, Samuel Spencer, so, you know. That is true. Okay, um, this... There's a little bit of backstory to this game. I played this, uh, yesterday? Well, yeah, it was yesterday. And it's pretty damn good. I liked it. It's not really a game, but it's pretty damn good. It's more of an experience. I'm playing as a lonely man on an island, and... Right, first of all, you see this... Lonely this... man on an island, and the entire game is just him pleasuring himself. Oh, shut up. <laughs> this is... This is like hex code for some... something. I'm not sure what. But it's like... Not hex code. It's like chemical... You know what I mean. Formula. Um, anyway, yeah. I play as a lone man on an island. There's no story to... Why did I just go really, really low? He just pleasured himself with the entire game. But... Shut up. My, my goal is to reach that red light up there. It's a beacon. The beacon of the island. Uh, oh, sounds like Lost. There we go. Boom. That was Inception. Yeah, I know. You idiot. Yeah, anyway. This is... um. This was... This was originally Half-Life 2 mod. It's, that's why it's just the source engine. That's what it is. This is running off the source yeah, okay. engine. Right now. Um, yeah, it was a mod and it was acclaimed for being amazing. So they made it into a standalone game and make you pay for it. So yeah, like a lot of money as well. Not, Not that bad. Got to have one, one loan boat. Oh no, I don't. <laughs> there's, there's no, there's no combat. The whole game is done with this um, voiceover of, uh, what's the word? Just like, it's like a novel that's being written as you're playing it. I, I'm, if you can't hear it, you can read it. I've put the subtitles on for your pleasure. So. <laughs> Just like the man on the island. Yep. They say he threw his arms wide in a valley on the south side and the cliff opened up to provide him shelter. They say he died of fever 116 years later. When I was here yesterday, there was a light in that cave, and it was creeping me out. But Donnelly records they never Why, is there a cow? No. A giant cow just standing there looking at you. have left my gifts, but like them, I appear to be an unworthy subject of his solitude. There are many points in this game where it's, it's like, creepy, but it's a normal kind of creepy. It's not creepy as in stuff's going to jump out at you, it's just creepy. Because them towels be hating. This is a very pretty game, though. I mean, just look. look. Look at that. I think this is a bit where I literally fall down. Yep. Yeah. You just fall down a cliff. You don't die, you just fall down. Yes, because you definitely won't die if you fall down a cliff. Shut up. It's amazing. There's a lobster pot there. Or whatever it's called. Lobsters. Well, I believe there's another bit of dialogue in a second. Because, uh, as I said, I've played this before. It's very strange. Don't even have a towel. Stupid nigger. Oh, and they, they are dying. It's up there. Rapid. There was once talk of a wind fire away from the rage and the intolerance of the masses. 
The sea, they said, is too rough for the turbines to stand. As um, Sam says, he does like to pleasure himself to this game. Yes, I indeed I do. Personally, I would have supported it. Turbines would be a fitting contemporary refuge for a hermit. A revolution. This man does talk about hermits a lot. Kermit the Frog. He, cur he blatantly Kermit the Frog. How did you guess? Oh, I'm rich. Can't remember if this is the way I was meant to go or not. Can't remember where the way down there went either, but hey, whatever. Reading Donnelly by the beat afternoon sun. Really getting into that. He landed on the south side of the island, followed the path to the bay and climbed the map. Really? He did not find the caves, and he did not chance. He didn't find the ca how do you not find the caves? I mean, his understanding of the island is flawed and complete. He stood on the mound and only wondered momentarily how to descend. Why do I mouse just appear for a second? That was weird. Huh. This is a pretty game. Look. Just look. It's like I'm on an island just like off the coast of Scotland. Mess in Scotland, they'll die. It's like I'm in an episode of Midsummer Murders or something. You mean Midsummer Stab? Yeah. Parallel lines cut into a What's that down there? You can see that. Is that like a Fibonacci spiral? You did not hear a thing. Our entire unit has perished, my lord! Parallel no. chalk lines. As you can see up there, parallel chalk lines. Never happened, Martin. GTFO the beach. You don't even have a towel. I know what you'll be doing next. Your men will be running from the battlefield. Shameful display. Well, actually, I'm doing okay. I have my um, bodyguards. I have 25. Oh, okay, they're the um, great. Uh, my what's it called? Naganata warrior monks gone. And now I've got the heroes left. In the middle of some flowers. These are pretty good. Ah, uh, this is one complaint I have about this game. Right. These plants you see here are just they're just 2D images. College. So when you walk over them, they all twist around, as you can see. It's just, it's, it's just one of those things that game makers have been doing for a long time, which What's that, Sam? loads of people have noticed, but I mean, nobody does anything about it. Hence why this new unlimited cloud point data thing that whoever it is is working on is going to be amazing. Because this will not happen. What won't happen, Sam? I have no idea what you're talking about. Just, just see, just, look, just watch the video. No, I mean, what are you actually talking about in the video? Uh, pl when you are when you see plants on the ground, you're like, oh, these are pretty cool 3D plants, and you just walk up to it, and it's a 2D image, which just rotates as you walk next to it. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know, it rotates to face you, so it always looks 3D. Mm. See this? These are all rotating to look at me. They're the same plant all the way through. It's like, it's like a creepy man turning around and staring at you all the time. <laughs> anyway. Yes, so I know exactly what that's like. Yeah. Anyway, as we continue to walk down this cliff, something happens. What is this? Nothing happens. Of minus one from all Ashiguri units. Yep, pretty much. You screwed. GTFO that beach. You don't even have a towel. Stupid. <gasps> oh. oh. Somehow, party in the vagina is trending on Twitter. Uh, okay. yeah. So, uh, uh, what? Oh. A small semi detached on the Liz, what? Quite literally, party in the vagina. How do you know this? Because I went on Twitter and it's there in the trending area. What's over in the ship over here, do you think? How, Martin, how good are, um, like, Naganata Warrior Monk heroes against, uh, Katana Samurai? That's not that good, actually. This I find the creepy they are at their worst against Katana Samurai. And very, very good. I have one left, and it's fighting to the death. Come okay. on. Um, I'll, I'll show you guys something in a second. Any... Wait. Is it just a towel? Or I'll show you now, even. Come back. Come on. My lone Naganata right. warrior hero. Here you go. What you just witnessed there is when you die in this game by drowning, falling off something, your character goes into a weird state of like imagination and just says, "Come back." 
Compost. Compost. Look at this. Isn't that weird? So it says compost. Clearly he says compost. Clearly he says compost. Compost. Let's just do it again here. You see flashbacks to stuff, the beacon and things. Come back. Let's just come back. And that, that's just that's just the respawn system in this game. Just, just thought I'd show that. You know. Anyway, into the cave we go. See over there? Where is it? There it is. That's where we were a bit ago. We were stood there. Oh yeah, come cool on, General. When you left, let's hope you uh, have a towel. What? Don't have a towel, man. My neck aches from staring up at the area. It mirrors the dull throb in my gut, where I'm sure I've begun to form my numbers. Where is this General? In my dreams. Why? Oh, it's walking up the walls. Head over her shoulder, staring along the motorway at the approaching traffic. Mm -hmm. More chemical things. And a What's going on here? thing. Go oh, fuck yourself. More thing. More th yeah, Chris, go suck yourself. Fuck. Suck. K. Ew. JJ Sport. Weird, man. To the game. JJ Sport to the <laughs> game. Uh, yeah. You, your references were so mixed up then, it's just. <laughs> <laughs> JJ Sports in the game. EA Sports to the game. It's not even to the game. It's in the game. It's it's That's in the, the game. game. It's not to the game. It's EA Sports. It's in the game. Google it. No. Do it. EA you, you're wrong. Sports to the game. There you go. That's better. Yeah, EA man. Sports. Just do it. Wait, what? <laughs> Hello, this bro. A seagull. Oh, fantastic. Just flying away into the distance. What about into the yeah. distant mist? EA. EA challenge everything. EA challenge everything. No, hang on, hang on, hang on. What's the Medal of Honor music? Battlefield. Medal of Honor. I'm gonna have to Google it. Oh, I win. Search. Girlfriend Portuguese. I'm blaming on that. With the livestock still here. Hey, hey, you, you. And put you on the ladder. And you put you on the ladder. No way, no way. Medal of Honor theme song. Mm -hmm. Are you still recording? Yeah. <laughs> Good start. So Make sure you have it in the video. Make sure you have it in the video. I thought it was going dun 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 Oh yes, I've got great guard now. There's a picture of Medal on the front line. Wow. You know, that D Day so Yeah. Can you hear that? Yeah. Yeah. Pretty loud. Hang oh, we on. went to a new chapter. I have a uh, great guard now. They're good. <coughs> oh, uh, Medal of Honor. Shot camera. They just crack into European oh. Assault. What was the game? No, it wasn't European Assault. It was like the third one. Dear Esther. Airborne Assault. I no oh, I'm ranked up. No. Oh, I can't remember it. It was. It was the best game, in my opinion. Ah, here's the first where he talks about the M5. Over 21 times you read that. Hang on, hang on. Over 21 times. 
not expensive and it tastes great. Can help you lose weight. Lane's can't hate. The phone is the boat. The boat ship shape. Wish we could date. It's so tip top. Imagine gonna hate being a woman civil war single handedly from the north. Oh, hang on. Cosmic Ross. He's got 12. You can write the Santa. You can bug an elf. You should call my eye date. Get the phone to vibrate. Sticking in my pocket. Then I touch myself. Had the Bluetooth on these. And I can tell you fucking up when I be talking about my behind. Get it, get it, get it. And they get it again and again. Get it, doesn't ever let me doesn't like a beehive. It's like an issue. Then you gotta love it. And the grubble with the feet of it. I'm pretty sure this video started with the words, I'm sorry, it had to be done. Uh, <laughs> yes. And there's only one thing that happens when you say, I'm sorry, it had to be done. <laughs> Check out the piano. Check out the little fucking piano. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Can we get the rub tub set? So, what? The rub tub? Yeah, it says nipple rub, cock rub, pussy rub. Um, okay. Compromised. Where you saw galaxies, I saw a Let's just read the description on this thing. But, uh, following on from our three best selling products, our new rub tub contains the three fabulous mini rubs. Pussy rub, a mild warming massage cream to enhance sensitivity and orgasm. Nipple rub. The newest member of our rub family is a slippery, silky foreplay gel for rubbing into nipples. It has a cooling, zingy sensation and a sweet, citrusy, lickable flavor. Cock rub. A mild warming massage cream to enhance sensitivity and orgasm. Cool. Literally don't care. Mm -hmm. It's normally that he talks about the boy which I was staring at, but for some reason he, he hasn't said it. Huh, okay. Say things about boys that you're staring at. Yes. You made the same joke yesterday when I was playing this with you. <laughs> I know I did. <laughs> I said, I I said he's looking quest. at a boy, and then you started going on about uh, looking at boys, lol, what? And then I came up to these shipping containers, and you were all like, troll all Africans. Wow. You said yeah, I was, I was like, troll all Africans. Juicy yeah. lube. I came, I came around here and I was mentioning how these are shipping containers that are broken, therefore I'm going to have to fight off a bunch of Africans in a minute. What's up here anyway? I didn't actually go up here yesterday. Okay, cool. Um, hey Martin, you are like game yet? Yeah? yeah, I'm loading, I'm um, sure you're going to know. Sexy beans. I don't know what's over here. Prada. What? Go this way. The operation, when I was still half I just gone in. Anesthetic. Your outline and your speech both blurred. Now my stones have grown into an island and made their escape. And you have been rendered opaque. You've been rendered car. opaque by the car of a drunk. <gasps> Do you hear that? Car of a drunk. Drunk? Yep. I wish I was drunk listening to that, Martin. Sorry. Uh, hey, Chris, I found a picture that I'll know you'll love. Is this what Paul saw through his windscreen? Not Lot's wife looking over her shoulder, but a scar in the hillside falling away to black forever. I think I should get a jungle. <laughs> what? I'm confused. You guys heard that as well, right? Yep. I didn't work out what it was. Please actually define what a vajazzle is. Well, it's when you put your face in a potato. Okay. Vajazzle. There's this house up on the top of this hill. Send that to Sam. Uh, no. No, Sam, you'll like it. No, I won't. Sam, you trust me. Okay. Chris, invite me. That's some weird ass nipple there. I will snatch the last the stables with no horses. The stone and, and I've been to the stables where there wasn't no horse. He's obviously had a baby. Sure. Uh, really? You sure? How do you know? Because her nipples are lactating, Sam. Yeah. You mad, bro? I knew the nipples were lactating. Exactly like my penis is lactating. I'm gonna make you wear some nipple 
Uh, what? There's no nipple clamps going on me. Fuck off. <laughs> Thought of that. <laughs> GTFO the beach. Where's that? You don't even have a towel. No, you can see that bit. Oh, this chair. This chair is comfortable. Oh, by the way, I got a new chair. It's amazing. The doctor was constructed originally oh, in the yeah. early 1700s. By then, shepherding. Tetsunamurada. The first habitual shepherd was a man called Jacobson from a lineage of migratory Scandinavians. He was not considered a man of breeding by the mainlanders. He came here every summer whilst building Bothy, hoping eventually that the such a property would secure him a wife and a lineage. Donnelly records that it did not. He caught some disease from his malcontented goats and died two years after completing it. Oh. White chocolate body paste. We can paint you black, and then like I could like lick half your face off, and then you could be like half black, half white. So I'd be a kinder, right? Yeah. Okay. Contents: my camp bed, a stove, a table, chairs, my clothes, my books. The caves that score out the belly of this lingerie. Lingerie. My limbs and belly famished. Lingerie, not lingerie. Organs, this lingerie. Are you lingering? I'm any lingering. I will descend into the caves and find oh, the phosphorescence home. Phosphorescence, Martin. Phosphorescence. Phosphorescence. Oh my God! Phosphorescence is just such a good word. If, if, as I said, as I said yesterday, if words were porn, <laughs> phosphorescence would be one of those words. Phosphorescence. Oh, Phosph it just rolls off your tongue, doesn't it? Phosphorescence. Oh, it just sounds like jizz worthy. Chris, you wouldn't know. You got what in English? Like G. I got B. Exactly, a G. <laughs> Sam, are you still recording? Yes. What the hell are you recording? Dear Esther. <laughs> Wait, you're actually still in Dear Esther? Yep. <laughs> I'm playing the whole thing. How long does it take? About an hour. Oh, sorry. <laughs> God damn it takes ages to load. He's talking about um some dead kid. Stop zooming stuff. Is there a console in this? That'd be awesome. Let's bring up a console and be all like, Troll, what's this? No, but oh, I don't remember going this way. I didn't go this way before. His body had been frozen right down to the nerves and had not even begun to decompose. He struggled halfway down the cliff path, perhaps looking for some lost goat, or perhaps in a delirium. And he tired, curled into a ah. right under the winter moon. See, what the hell? Even the animals shunned his corpse. The mainlanders thought to bring it home unlucky. Donnelly claims they came to the caves to thaw it's out a clue. the heart. But he is proving an unreliable witness. I beg to differ. Uh, no. Just, just dive and see what happens. <laughs> there we go to. <laughs> oh. Come back. Come back. Uh, your toenail! It's sexy. Give me your toenail! But what? Get your toenail out, you've got otherwise I'm not kissing you. Oh, what? What? Um. <laughs> the screen is literally. Just Get black. Spit it out. Penis. I spat it out there. Who did it? I won't spit your penis out. Give it there. Why did it take me so long to bloody find a game? Ah, there we go. Shh. I, mean, I had control, but there's nothing showing on the screen. That was very, very weird. Ah, oh, there we go. That was weird. That was very weird. Anyway. Let's carry on. Hang on, man. I'll just restart the search. Lol, what? Cool story. Uh, multiplayer, dear Esther. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Seriously, multiplayer? <laughs> that would be the most stupid oh, idea ever. <laughs> 
What? Flick it? Horny goat weed. This powerful effective stamina gel is exclusive to Ann Summers with proven ingredients such as Langarenti and horny goat weed. Why are you on Ann Summers? I don't know. I don't know why she's on Ann Summers. Why do you think I'm on Ann Summers? Lingerie? Yes. Uh, no thanks. That is a scary image. Yeah. Welcome to your orgasm. Uh, no thank you. <laughs> That's what it says! No, no, scared, scared, I'm, I'm scared. Place, I slipped and fell and injured my leg. I think the femur is broken. Ah! Ah! The skin Get the anal plug away from me! This is scary. The is crashing in on waves, winter tides against my shoreline, drowning out the ache of my stone. This is one of the creepy moments, the, that's just that noise in the background. But it has become clear that there is only one way this is likely to end. The medical supplies I looted from the trawler have suddenly found their purpose. Hey Sam, would you be alright if I buy you some horny goat weed? Uh, yeah, sure. Alright, let's see how much. As long as you send me the Pokemon poster. Why do I just send you something in order for Chris to send me something? Does because that make any it's, sense? It's me. Problem. And you owe me a Pokemon poster. Mega I do. What's this? Horny goat weed is more than just the name. Good. No, it's not. There you go. Just, just oh, get off. Man. Just get off Anne Summers and go on. Uh, what's the word? Oh, God, Holland and Barrett. Holland and Barrett. Yes, clearly. No. Oh, oh God damn it. What's it called? Oh. Mm, I'm gonna have to Google it in a minute, aren't I? Passionate pussy masturbator. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Rock soft raspberry arseberry butt plug. Mm. Put a ring on it, couple's cock ring set. Ling O purple clit stim. Yep. Monkey spanker male masturbator. <laughs> go on go on abstin abstinence dot com. Go to abstinence dot com. What? Just just get off Ann Summers and go to abstinence.com. <laughs> abstinence.com. You don't need any of the Ann Summers stuff. Just abstinence. 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 Jesus. If you look on Ann Summers for lingerie, why are you looking at all the cock stuff? Why are you asking me? Because she really yeah. likes so, so it's called relay, Chris. I relay it to you, and then you relay it to her. Okay, say it again. No. If you're on Anne Summers looking for lingerie, why are you looking at all the penis stuff? Because I'm cool. Because she's cool. I'm seeing what I'm doing with you. Uh, you know what you need to get, Mr. Limpy? <laughs> Slap and tickle. Yeah, Plus, I'm Mr. Limpy for your birthday. You need to get uh, a knife to cut it off. I'll get that. Yeah, you can get that What's it called when a stalactite and a stalagmite meet uh, in the middle? The a column? A pillar? Oh, I'll send the link to you. Uh, okay. It's Sam, it's just called a pillar. Because it, it is, isn't... It's literally just called a pillar. I thought it had a special name, like... I can't remember what the word is, but... Stalagite. Stal clearly stalagite. Stalagite. It's called horny goat weed. So, uh, Courtney is caught me. Courtney okay. is asking me to relay this to you. I have no idea. Uh, I'm gonna click it. I'm not. Oh. I'm not looking at any wow. link. Just, there is just, no just other tell direction. me. Um, no other exit from this motor. No okay. exit from motorway. Look. Speeding past this junction. Circuit diagram. Waiting at the roadside. <laughs> one last drink. Of Sam, uh, I've, got, I've got a present for you. You bet. You just buy me it. Another <laughs> chemical. <laughs> Some more stuff, like some stuff. Perfect with Roger Mordor. <laughs> Roger Mordor. I don't even want to know. Is what's that the symbol for in um, electrical engineering? I've forgotten. What? It's, it's one of those things where it's like a field, a field, you know. Creates like a like an electromagnetic field around something. It's used in like hearing aids and things. 
Oh, um. Uh, uh, thingy loop. Coil. It's not coil. It's like something loop. Uh, electro loop. It, no. Magnetic. Loop. Chris, do you take any kind of electrical engineering course? No. Then please shut up. <laughs> This is where I look just to jump down. Yep. Just travelling up this cave. Walking up a stream. I must be soaking wet by now, but it's alright, because once again I'm in a game I don't have any legs. Or any body. It's, I don't understand that. You don't have any legs or body yet. You're walking. The around. number one thing I just want in a game is just to see my own legs. You you look down and you, I want to see my own legs, but no, there's nothing. <laughs> if I ever get into making games properly, which I will, I'm going to make mm. characters which have legs. That's going to be my main priority. Well, from their view anyway. Yeah. Mm. Or just have a third-person game where you can quite clearly see the body. Mm. Mass Effect on. Uh, no. Tanks. <laughs> Therefore, you don't need any type of view. What, what would that view be called? Because it's not second, third, or first person. What, what are you on about? Tanks. It's like a side scroller. What? Are you on about the game that I made? Mm hmm. Uh, that's. side view. Just a side view. Is that what it's called? I don't know. A 2D landscape. Yeah, I reckon. Oh, I should totally try and remake this map in um Minecraft. Um, but while I come up to the top of this, I'm going to save and come back later on. Yeah, sit down here, look up, and save and wait till later on. Just pause. I'll see you guys in a minute. Hey guys, we're back. At the same point this time. I'm on my own. Just. The same fate as the island man I'm playing with, as all my friends have gone to bed or died. Yep, I knew it. Now, I know the right way here, I've just what never been this way. That's just the thing with this game. You j you don't you don't play it to finish. You just play it to just explore. Look how beautiful this cave is. Just look. Where does this go? What's down here? Ah, do you see those paper boats? They'll be explained later on. Believe me, they will be explained later on. Oh, this game is just so pretty. Look at all those uh, stalactites. There's a stalagmite. Oh god, stalactites—they're pretty damn cool. Imagine if one of them fell on my head and I died. That'd be great. <laughs> hmm. Just carry on. This is a game that doesn't need that many words. What's down here? Let's have a look. There's really not much to talk about in this game. It's just. There's no action. There's just. Completely surreal. Uh, what's the word? Atmospheric. It's a boat without a bottom. Tide. Yeah. What's over here? Let me up. Let me up, please. 
piece. Oh, as I explained, this is the source engine, and it's broken. <laughs> well, it's the source engine, which it's. Not, I mean, it's not the. It's not amazingly, you know, glitch-proof. You know what I mean? There are many glitches. Like uh, in a in a little bit in the future, there are some stairs in this game, and I remember when I first played it, it took me like two minutes to get up these stairs because I was just stuck at the bottom. The just the step itself was just stopping me, and it was very very strange. There's nothing wrong with the stairs. I mean, that was the way it was meant to be going. It just didn't let me go up there at all. It was very very strange. Just just ignore the the glitches. Look at that. Just look. What's this? Another chemical thing. This is just... This is just stunning. See, I really want to make a game like this that just makes you stop and think just like, wow just completely stops you and you just go, you, you literally just verbally just go wow this has been an experience whatever that is this area is weird I, if I remember rightly I can't actually climb, no I can't climb up there there's another chemical thing right in front, you see that? I think I'm coming up to the this top of the cave now this is the face reflected in the moonlit waters it can only be a dead shepherd who has come to drunk drive you home. I get the impression that he says different things. Because when I first came through, he said something along the lines of this cannot be where the goats died. Hmm. Very strange. Very odd. Behold, Damascus is taken. Look at this phosphorescence. That was very, very strange. Game kind of something weird. Paused it and it went weird. Uh anyway. Yes, phosphorescence, uh what just happened? I just like sank. Did you hear that weird noise in the background? Way from being a city away from being a city and it shall be a ruinous keep I don't know what's this? this is like vines growing down this is very strange this is a s very surreal game it, it, it just gives you an enormous sense of just loneliness. That's the whole point. It's just this man is just lonely. His his wife, I think we've gathered by now, has has died at the hands of a drunk driver. We assume, but it's just it's like oh, you feel genuine remorse for what just happened. You feel genuine remorse for him. <laughs> you see that I like sank like stone. Genuine remorse and sadness for the character. <coughs> yeah, by the way, the controls for this are literally just WASD and the mouse just to look around. It's, there's no, as I said, there's no combat, there's no shooting, there's no, there's nothing like that. A C T S twenty two two zero whatever. Jump. This is the strange part though. Hang on, this is different. This is different. When I came here before, there was a doctor's table. As opposed to two cars. This is strange. Oh, let's go and locate where we actually are. Oh, 
reporter said Southwest, Western, and something. Western Supermare? M5? I think. Very surreal. This car doesn't have a license plate. She's gone. She's gonna be I'm running on the motorway. I think after a certain amount of length you do just apparate back into existence. Although this is just Yeah, there we go. That bit is just... Oh. It's just such, such a... Surreal. Yeah. Oh. I do have to congratulate whoever wrote the music in this game though. It's... it's second to none. It just fits so brilliantly. I just... it's just amazing. Amazingness! There's a hole up there. Where do you think it leads? I'm going to say vagina. Um, what? Nothing. Nothing, 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 nothing. Cutscene. Cutscene. Okay, we'll come back. Okay. Okay, guys. We are back. It's actually, um... I have to tell you something first. Uh, my footage after this bit crashed before, so this is actually being recorded several weeks after I first did the first bit. Just thought I'd mention that. I can't, I can't quite remember everything that's happened or everything that I've said. So if I say something again, just, just bear with it, okay? Look at that paint, phosphorescence. Remember that. Where was I heading? This way. Oh, music. Oh. 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 The moon over the Sanford Junction had lights in your retinas. Donnelly drove a grey hatchback without a bottom. All the creatures of the tarmac rose to sing to him. All manner of symbols crudely scrawled across the cliff face of my unrest. My life reduced to an electrical diagram. All my gulls have taken flight. They will no longer roost on these outcrops. The lure of the moon over the Sanford Junction is too strong. Uh, yeah. So if I remember, if I remember rightly, we just came from the part where I was underwater in a car. Or no, I was underwater and there was a car. Or was there a car? Was there? I can't remember. I've played this twice now, and there's been a car, and at the time there was the doctor surgery thing. So, whichever one fits, just... <laughs> uh, we came from there, we went in some caverns, did some stuff. And now we're out here, trying to find the beacon. I just walked back myself to go up this path, that path led to nowhere. Oh, actually, it did lead to some... Oh, fuck! I have to go down there. <laughs> uh, some candles up here. If I remember rightly, this part is the bit where it gets really creepy. Well, not creepy. Just different. Phosphorescence, yay! Yeah, I want to go down here. <laughs> Let's see. Come on. Oh, I wish this man would walk faster. Is there any reason for going out here? I can't remember. Oopsie. <laughs> well, that was a good reason, I suppose. I'm gonna have to swim back now. I don't think there's another way up. Fuck it. Let's just, let's just die. Oh, I'm not sure if it is dying, but you know what I mean. Come back. Come back. 
I'm a little child. Whoa. Okay, let's go. <laughs> oh, what's this way? What's down here? I was over there, now I'm over here. What is this? How do I jump? I can't. I'm a failure. <laughs> <laughs> this is brilliant. <laughs> this is going brilliant so far. Oh, here's a rock. Have fun with this. Are you kidding me? Thank you. Jesus. Barbed wire. LOL. Don't get cut. LOL. Oh, this game is just... It's just... What? What is this game? I don't, I, I don't even know. Are there words? No. Do I, oh look, there's a plane over there. Well, contrails. Whoa, whoa. Up there is where things get creepy. I've got to make my way up to the top of that thing. I'm not quite sure why the whole purpose of this game is to get to that beacon. It just is because I don't know. Of fire and soil, I chose fire. It seemed the more contemporary of the options, the more sanitary. I could not bear the thought of the reassembly of such a ruin. Stitching arm to shoulder and femur to hip, charting a line of thread like traffic stilled on a motorway, making it all acceptable for tearful aunts and traumatized uncles flown in specially for the occasion. Reduce to ash, mix with water, make a phosphorescent paint for these rocks to see. Uh, yeah, I saw a cave up here, and I just wonder what was in it. I can't remember. Fully. Oh, it's the place with the tires, I think. I don't know. I don't know. What's this? This is hospital equipment. Some pills. Pills here. And pills here. I got some pills here. Some defibs. And some pills. And syringe. And shit. <laughs> well, wasn't that fun? Wasn't that a fun experience? That was. I hope you all enjoyed that experience of pills and some syringes. Well, there's just a syringe, you know what I mean. Shut up. <laughs> oh, this man walks so slowly. I'm pressing shift because this is based on the uh, Half-Life engine. But it doesn't work. <laughs> you can just imagine. Yet yeah, this character, he's not whoever the hell his name was, I've already forgotten. Uh, he's actually Gordon Freeman. This is this is an attachment to Half Life. This is Half Life Three, everyone. Uh, no enemies. It's just just an experience. What's this? <gasps> it's a picture of a little child. <gasps> I hear the creepy noise. Did you hear that? It's very it's creepy. Oh, got What's this? Anyone can tell me what this is. I will give them literally no prize. Let's just listen to the waves. Listen to the waves and the ocean. Oh, what song is that from? Well, he says something like, Listen to the waves and the ocean. Those are the lyrics, not the tunes. Just, I can't remember. Because I'm a noob. Here's the tyres. Yay! Car crash! Yay! Yay! Car crash! Yay! Car crash! I'm bored of walking. Oh my god. There were chemical diagrams on the mug he Good. got coffee in. Sticky at the handle where his hand shook. He worked for a pharmaceutical company with an office based on the outskirts of Wolverhampton. He'd been travelling back from a sales conference in Exeter, forming a strategic vision for the peddling of antacid yoghurt to the European market. You could trace the connections with your finger, join the dots, and whole new compounds would be summoned into activity. Cool. I think that says something about a light that shone from heaven, shone in my anus, or something like that. I don't really know. I've forgotten what this whole thing is about. Noises. This. Dead seagulls? What? OK, 
Okay. Get it. From Don't get jumped. I can see my armada. I collected all the letters I'd ever meant to send to you. If I'd have ever made it Is to the mainland, nice? but it instead collected at the bottom of my rucksack, and I spread them out along the lost beach. Then I took each and every one, and I folded them into boats. I folded you into the creases, and then, as the sun was setting, I set the fleet to sail. Shattered into twenty-one pieces, I consigned you to the Atlantic, and I sat here until I'd watched all of you sink. None of them have sank. So you didn't even launch some of them. Let's count how many there are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. There's one missing. <gasps> dun dun dun. It's probably not. I'm just useless at counting. <laughs> how do I get up here? What's this? That's where I'm meant to go, but this is where I'm actually going. Because, in here, there's nothing. In here, there is... <gasps> We're having bird's nest! On a sudden, a light from heaven shone around him, and he fell to the ground. I was like... <laughs> and I died, died. What the hell there? Oh, I let go of the zoom, and I'm like, whoa. Oh, God. Uh, What did I do? Okay, I done goofed and did something weird, and I'm back. <laughs> I, I, I I pretty much just tabbed out, and then it broke, and I was like, oh, shoot. Anyway, what was I saying? Yeah, bird's nest in there, probably something to do with eggs, I'm an egg, blah, 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 blah. I'm not an egg. Can't go on the roof, I've tried before. <laughs> Trust me. Here's where the creepiness happens. I'm like, do 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 Yeah, you can tell it's been a while because whenever I last played this, the troll old man was still alive, and now he he kind of died. Yeah, sad times, sad times. On a related note, I was playing Red Orchestra 2 with uh, a sound friends. Of metal. Oh, shut up! Running over the edge of the rock, oh. a moon that casts a signal. As I lay pinned beside you, the ticking of the cooling engine and the calling from a great height, all my mind as a bypass. Anyway, I was playing it with YouTube users, uh, Spamty Spam and Gingy 231, and. We start singing the Troll Lol song, and a man, there was some other guy on our team, who just told us that it was it was too soon. It was too soon. Look, this is what I was talking about. Do you see that figure? Look, look at the figure. Where's he gone? Oh, God. Look, look at the figure. Look at the figure. Look at the figure. Don't take your eyes off the figure. You see that? That is clearly a person. I'm trying to keep my eyes on him at all times. I've begun my voyage in a paper boat without a bottle. I will fly to the moon in it. I've been folded along a crease in time, a weakness in the sheet of life. Now you've settled on the opposite side of the paper to me. Can't see me. Can see your traces in the ink that soaks through the fiber, the pulped vegetation. Where have they gone? When we become waterlogged and the cage disintegrates, we will intermingle. When this Ooh. paper aeroplane leaves the cliff edge and casts parallel vapor trails in the dark, <laughs> we will come together. We all come together, yeah, 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 yeah. It's Nickelback, by the way, singing about African children. I don't know why. Um, yeah, person not there anymore. I'm scared. What's this? And he was proceeding on his journey. That's true. I am walking up to there. Oh God, the slave just left. Oh my god! <sighs> I believe this is the part with the um, weird purple valley. Oh yeah, and I, was, I, was, I mentioned the graphics before, didn't I? About these flat plants that just spin around so that you're looking at them in the right direction all the time, yeah. 
Admittedly, they look good, but I mean, when you walk over like that, it's like, what the fuck? That's where unlimited data thingy comes in. If only Donnelly had experienced this, he would have realized he was his own shoreline, as am I. Just as I am becoming this island, so he became his syphilis, retreating into the burning synapses, the stones, the infection. Pretty much he became an STD by, um, not walking to a doctor's. I don't know. I'm not paying any more attention. I just want to finish this stupid video. It's been long enough. I don't even care. There are headlights reflected in these retinas. I don't care what's Too reflected in, in your anus. My island without a bottom. The sea creatures have risen to the surface, but the gulls are not here to carry them back to their nests. I've become fixed, open and staring, an eye turned on itself. I've become an infected leg whose tracking lines form a perfect map of the junctions of the M5. I will take the exit at mid thigh and plummet to my Esther. What? I will suddenly become a lot slower in here. What's that burning noise? Hear that? Oh. Oh. Look at this! Yeah! Gonna spray at all the boats! <laughs> then I ran out of ammo and died. Oh, what's this? Did anyone else just see that shadow? Keep me out a little bit. What's that? I don't care, let's go. Oh my god, hurry up. It's a piece of wood, don't care. I'm so close now, I know that I know that all I've got to do is go up that path and I'm there. Uh -huh. Shut please behind me. It'd be laws if it did. Hello random candle. You're my only friend. Bum, 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 my only friend. The end. Look at that. Jesus Christ. Hurry up. <laughs> Not even holding the mouse anymore. I just don't care. I just, I just don't care at all. A gull perched on the spent Good. sideways, whilst the sirens what? fell through the middle distance and the metal moaned in grief about us. I'm about this night in walking. Old bread and gull bones. Old Donnelly at the bar gripping his drink. Old Esther walking with our children. Old Paul as ever. Old Paul. He shakes and he shivers and he turns off his lights alone. Okay. Yeah, I don't remember if I mentioned, but this is based on the... Uh this was based on the Half-Life engine, I know I mentioned that, but this was originally a mod for it, you know, like the elevator source mod, those kind of things. I do want to play, by the way, somewhere. Um, yeah, but they were all like, oh my god, this is amazing, let's release it as a full game, and made people pay for it. They are money-grabbing tentacles, etc. I'm nearly finished now, don't worry, guys. <laughs> Listen to me drone on for an hour plus near I don't know what time is how long I've been playing, I don't care to be honest. It's been too long. Here we go. We I've leaving. run out of places to climb. I will abandon this body and take to the air. Essentially I'm gonna jump. I think. I say I think I know. Dear yeah. Esther, I have burned my Just listen, my just listen. My book Shut up death just listen. Shh. Mine will be written Shh. all across this island. Who was Jacobson? Who remembers him? Me, I remember. Donnelly has written of him, but who was Donnelly? Who remembers him? I do. I have painted, carved, hewn, scored into this space all that I could draw from him. Good. There will be another to these shores to remember me. I will rise from the ocean like an island without bottom, come together like a stone, become an aerial, a beacon, that they will not forget you. I forgot him. Who's being drawn to you? One day the gulls will return and nest in our bones and our history. I will look to my left and see Esther Donnelly flying beside me. Good. I will look to my right and see Paul Jacobson flying beside me. Good. They will leave white lines carved into the air to reach the mainland, where help 
will be sent. And now I'm like, tra la 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 I'm gonna jump. I'm a maniac, maniac on the floor. And I'm dancing like I've never danced before. Damascus, see that? See that? More lines in the cliff saying something or other. There's a candle over there. We're falling. We're just falling. Do you remember this from earlier on? I was walking around here. Do you remember? Do you remember? I'm going to fall and die on it. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. Lol. Jakey, Jakey, I'm a bird. <laughs> the the aerial panning shot of the whole island. Not the whole island. Just part of it. <gasps> that is pretty much the end of the game, so we're just going to zoom into the paper boats here. Um, I can't really say much about this game apart from this. I, li I like it. I just like how beautiful and like heartfelt the meaning of it is. <sighs> but otherwise, that's it. Make your own impressions of this game, and um, I would highly recommend buying it. But I mean, it's personal preference, to be honest. I don't think it's that expensive. I think it's less than a five at the moment. It's pretty good. An hour of gameplay. This experience is pretty good. And this, this, my friends and fellow subscribers, is the end of Dear Esther. Hope you enjoyed. Remember to rate, comment, and subscribe if you want to see a video similar to this one. No, I'm not critical. I'm just kidding. Just, just yeah, do just, just, just do that. Okay. Okay, guys. There, there is no ending to this either. There's, there's credits. Do you want to see the credits? Fine, we'll go and see the credits. Okay, options. No, options. Um. What? 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 Oh, there they are. Yeah, here's the credits. People made them. They're, they're pretty good. Um, yeah, make your own impressions of this game. And I'm just going to leave you to roll out on the credits, guys. So I'll see you next time.